Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Afneet. Welcome to welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, if you remember, I posted this Ask Me Anything community post on YouTube like two months ago, and eventually, today, I will be answering all your questions. But before that, the shout out for this week's video goes to Amulya and Heather. Thank you guys. You know what? You guys make my day literally so if you want a shout out in my next week's video comment anything that includes this word exuberant so now let's get started with the 1k special q a first let me introduce myself my name is avneet kaur i'm from punjab i just got promoted to 12th grade i am 17 years old i have an elder sister i guess that's it i have all the questions here in my laptop so now let's start off with easy ones <laughs> The first question is, which is your favorite song? Uh, I do not have a specific song, but lately I have been listening to 1989 album of Taylor Swift. Uh, who is your inspiration? I'll get to this question later in the video, so stay tuned. Who supports you the most for making videos? My sister is my biggest supporter. Will you continue making videos? Um, yes, I love making filming recording editing videos and i love interacting with all of you so i don't think i will ever stop making videos in the near future and the most important question aapke toothpaste mein namak hai wait wait i got my toothpaste here now let's sorry now let's check if it has namak in it ranim babul tomar pudina long peepli bajar danti ra bakul bi dang haldi pilu maju phool Apparently, it doesn't have salt in it. That was legitness. Yeah, it was. Huh? So no, मेरे toothpaste में नमक नहीं है. That was a good one. Next, you are an excellent in art and craft. Thank you so much. Your drawing is too amazing. Why you haven't taken it in eleventh? By the way, I'm asking this casually. Okay, so let me explain. I wanted to take fine arts as my fifth subject, but teachers told me there that they won't teach 11th graders and you have to do everything on your own so that's why i dropped this idea everybody asks me this particular question <laughs> okay what are your detailed plans after 12th have you thought what do you want to pursue for your higher education what course are you going to take after high school to be honest even i don't know i'm so confused myself but I'm pretty sure I'm going to do something creative like fashion and business combined. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> Subscribe to my YouTube channel if you want to see how it goes. Next. How are you scoring in 11th percentage or marks? I scored 85% in my 11th grade. Yes. I scored less in my maths and economics exam and that won't happen in 12th. I promise. something you want in life but there's a very less chance you will get it this is really a thought provoking question now let me guess i don't think there is anything i'm a get whatever i want <laughs> most embarrassing memory of yours embarrassing memory i can't remember anything now but i was once sent to our principal's office as i was accused of dating a boy in 6th grade lol yes yes <laughs> funny right have you ever failed in an exam no i have never failed in any of my exam that's my flex flex how is life young one life is pretty to be honest but i don't think i'm giving enough time to appreciate how beautiful it really is everything is happening as quick as a flash how is your health i'm okay health wise i just have a sore throat how are you how is studies 12th is so hectic for me i go to school then tuition then after coming from tuitions i have to do self study like i am not at all managing this all well i just cry it out and move on I hope it will get better soon. What is your dream rather than studies? I don't have a dream. I have goals and my long-term goal is to be happy, rich and famous 
and i really really want to make my family happy and proud i think that's everyone's goal isn't it do you think that the grading education system in india should change like they should focus on how much the student understood what is your opinion that's a really good question yes i do believe that india should entirely change its education system instead of focusing on rote learning they should incorporate project based learning in the country i have a lot to say on this topic and i guess this deserves a separate video let me know in the comments if you want the video or not <laughs> next has anyone near you suicided near your area after failing in main exams um i knew my sister's friend who took her own life even before the declaration of 12th grade results but the thing is she did not fail in fact she got a really good percentile and it was way more disheartening because of that next what equipment do you use to make videos app or software used to edit your videos okay i get this question a lot i use my iphone 11 to record my videos and i use capcut to edit my videos and i use pixart fonto and adobe sketch for the thumbnails um let me know in the comments if you want a detailed video on how i edit my videos i would love to make that How do you keep up with YouTube studies personal life? I started my YouTube journey last year after my boards got cancelled. I was completely free for 5 months. During that time I started posting consistently on YouTube. When you do something repeatedly, it becomes an easy job for you. And when my school started, I was so used to filming, editing, recording, posting videos every week that it didn't take much time. You know what I mean? Are you getting my point? What I'm trying to say? I still don't know how I manage, but I know one thing for sure that I don't over pressurize myself for making videos. If I don't want to make videos, I will not. I will take a break because mental health comes first. <laughs> Motivational speaker 101. <laughs> Next, your inspiration. Who is my inspiration? Zoya Abbas is who I look up to in case of YouTube. I have been watching her since 6th grade and I love how she has grown into a beautiful person. How she has evolved. She is the one who inspired me to start a YouTube channel. I will link her channel down in the description box. Go check it out. She is queen your role model i don't know who is my role model i don't know i don't know how to stay motivated all the time i say this all the time but let me say it again you will never always be motivated as motivation comes and goes you have to learn to be disciplined as it will stay forever i recommend you to read this atomic habits book by james clear i recently started it and it's amazing it definitely deserves all the hype that it's getting your hobbies i love reading eating sleeping editing and also i love doing arts and crafts your future goal i have already told you that do you like bts if yes then who is your bias i actually don't stand any particular group as i am more of a k drama girl and not a k pop fan <laughs> as for k drama my all time favorite is vincenzo you should definitely definitely watch it and we can discuss it later at last you are my role model and you will be a big youtuber one day oh my god thank you so much this makes my day you are so sweet and also how many hours do you self study i do not have a specific count that i will study for this many hours every day i study when i feel like studying and i set my goals like i will study until i am done with this one topic or one chapter some days i do not study at all which is your favorite sport <laughs> i'm not really a sporty type of person i've never liked outdoor games as a child maybe because i never had anyone to play with but i sometimes enjoy playing badminton Who is your favorite person in your surrounding? Of course, my parents and my sister. Do you have any kind of pets? I love animals. It's just that I don't like them. You know what I mean? No, I never had any pet in my life, and I don't want to have one. So next, which school are you studying at? 
I study in Chandigarh and I don't think I should reveal my school's name. What is your skincare routine of need? By the way, your skin looks beautiful. Oh my god, thank you so much ladies. To be honest, I really don't have a skincare routine. I just wash my face with the face wash and I apply this Lakme soft cream. Yeah. That's it. No skin care One tip I will give you is that stay hydrated. Thank you again. <laughs> Tell us about your school life, like the most memorable ones. Um, I really loved my school life until 8th grade. Never had the same kind of fun again. But hey, college is awaiting me, right? So you never know. What is your idea about life? Life's too short. So go do whatever you want and stop caring about what other people would think. Have you ever had a mental breakdown while making a video? Oh my god, many times. Let me show you a clip here. I look pretty while crying. <laughs> oh my god. How can I cry while dressed up? These videos never make it to YouTube because I can't get myself to edit these videos. How did you get inspired to open YouTube channel and upload videos? Okay, now I get this question a lot too. Let me explain. I have been watching YouTube since 6th grade. I have watched Lily Singh, Komal Pandey, Sejal Kumar and many other YouTubers become the best version of themselves. And I have always wanted to start a YouTube channel of my own. This channel did not come just out of boredom this has always been my dream my first channel's name was sticky paper queen <laughs> i just googled it and just typed it <laughs> and then i thought of starting a dancing youtube channel but then i soon realized that i suck at dancing so i did not take it seriously back then as i thought i need pretty quality camera ring light tripod and other equipment to start a youtube channel but the thing is you do not just start filming with any smartphone that you have and everyone has their cringe faces how do you expect to reach the top if you won't even start so this is your sign to go and start a youtube channel if you've been meaning to start one cheat in online exams yes i used to everybody does what kind of question is that apne commerce kyunli okay let me explain i have always wanted to take humanities until august of last year i was sure that i don't want to take non medical or pcm or medical or pcb because everyone in my family or my extended family is either an engineer or a doctor i wanted to do something else something different i realized history sociology and other subjects in art stream won't help me with my future career but commerce accountancy business studies are real world subjects and we are definitely gonna need these also i love business so that's why i chose commerce and i'm enjoying it to be honest how are you Oh my god thank you so much for asking i have been better this beginning of new academic year have been so overwhelming that i don't know what to do plus the thought of what i will do after 12th is like i'm so confused right now i'm like a fork of a road i remember the poem by robert frost that i read in 9th grade i guess Hopefully I will find my way soon. Thank you so much for asking. How are you? Let me know in the comments. Where do you see yourself in 5 years? I will finish my 12th grade by April or May next year, then college for 4 years. So yes. So hopefully I would be happy and in college. <laughs> in 5 years existed. Snapchat account A Garewal 5555 4 times 5. Next How do you get back on track when you think you are falling off stairs? I take the break if that's what I need and then I plan everything on notion. I start off by accomplishing a small yet important task. Yeah, that's how I do it. Who you think is really motivating you all the time other than family? To be honest, myself. No one else. What is your dream destination? London and New York. Welcome to New York. It's been waiting What is the first thing you notice when you meet someone? Their face and dress sense. 
like i'm the type of person who judge a book by its cover what is your favorite medium of art to work with i like watercolors then acrylics and i prefer soft pastels over oil pastels what are the secret behind your overall perfection i am not at all perfect you only see the happy confident merry merry side of me it's because i choose to record myself when i feel confident and not when i'm insecure about my body or myself in general do not form opinions uh, based on some 10 to 15 minutes video people are much more than that okay everybody has flaws so social media is fake you should know that by now next why are you so sweet and aesthetic dear ah thank you so much i don't know i'm not sweet am i you all are so sweet thank you so much okay so i guess that's it oh, you guys asked me a lot of questions i did not think that i would get these many questions i am so grateful to have all of you here thank you so much for 1000 subscribers again this wouldn't have been possible without all your support thank you yes that's the end of this video i hope you enjoyed watching this and if you did don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to my youtube channel i'll see you in my next video till then stay safe bye bye